I think I can demolish the atheistic argument permanently. With the death of God, many other things die, things you don't expect. And one of the things that dies when God dies is science, and no one expected that. How so? Because science as a practice is a religious practice. It's predicated on religious axioms. You have to believe that there's such a thing as truth. You have to believe that the truth is understandable. You have to believe that understanding the truth is good. You have to believe that there is such a thing as good. Right? So imagine, to be a scientist, you have to imagine that, first of all, that the world is comprehensible to the human intellect. But more, that if you investigate the mysteries of the material world, that that will be beneficial. Right? Those aren't scientific claims. Those are metaphysical claims. And that metaphysical claim is nested in a story. You know, and the, the Enlightenment types, they've portrayed the scientific revolution as something contrary to the religious substrate. And that's not accurate. That's a French revolution. That's a Luciferian intellect history. It's not true. The universities grew out of the monasteries. That's where the universities came from. And science, as a widespread enterprise, got its start in the universities. Hey folks, this is Jeff from This Week with JTT, and that one from Jordan Peterson was very powerful. So please tell me, what are your thoughts on that? Leave your thoughts in the comments down below. Thank you. Stay blessed.